Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. So this is our third theorem in geometry. We have to prove that the triangles standing on same base and between the same parallel lines are equal in area. So if we had two triangles which are standing on the same base, and if they are between the same parallel lines, then their areas are equal. That's our theorem. So first, let's make a line. Let's make another line which is parallel to this line. Let's name this line AB and this line CD. So these two lines that we have here are parallel to each other. Now what we are going to do is we are going to make a triangle on the space AB. So let's make a triangle like this one. So we have our triangle ABD uh, standing on the base AB and it is between the parallel lines CD and AB. Now what we are going to do is we are going to make another triangle on the same base AB, okay? And between the same parallel lines AB and CD. So now what we have is we have two triangles, right? This one ABC and ABD, which are standing on the same base AB and are between the same parallel lines AB and CD. Now what our theorem tells us is that the area of these two triangles must be equal. So first, let's just write the given things, right? So we have our solution and we have our given. So we are going to write the given from this figure. So we have triangle ABC and triangle ABD standing on the same base AB and between the same parallel lines CD and AB. And that's what we are going to write in our given. So that's what we have written over here, right? Triangle ABC and triangle ABD are standing on the same base AB and between the same parallel lines CD and AB. Now that we have written our given thing, the second thing that we need to write is to prove. So what we are trying to prove here is the area of this triangle ABC and this triangle ABD are equal because they are standing on the same base and between the same parallel lines. So we need to prove area of triangle ABC is equal to area of triangle ABD. Now, the third step is we need to make a construction in this proof, okay? So we have our construction. What we are going to construct in this theorem is we are going to make a line from this A in this direction, right? such that it is parallel with this BD line, okay? So we have our line from A in such a way that it is parallel to this BD. So let's name this point E. So we have our line AE parallel to BD. And that's what we are going to write in our construction, okay? Draw AE parallel to BD. So in our construction, we have draw AE parallel to BD. And now we can finally prove our theorem, okay? So we have our proof. In our proof, we are going to have statements and reasons, right? So statements and reasons. So I've just copied the mini version of our figure over here because we need to look at this to prove our theorem, right? So in our number one, what we are going to write is the area of this triangle ABD, okay? This triangle ABD is half of the area of this parallelogram A, B, D, E. So, area of triangle A, B, D is equal to half of area of parallelogram A, B, D, E. The reason is our previous theorem, okay? So the area of triangle is half the area of parallel standing on the same base between same parallel lines. See, this triangle ABD is standing on the base AB and this parallelogram ABDE is also standing on the base AB and they are between the same parallel lines CD and AB. And when that happens, what we know from our previous theorem is that the area of this triangle is going to be half of this parallel. So our theorem was area of triangle is half of parallelogram 
standing on same base and between same pair lines. Now our number two is going to be area of triangle ABC is also going to be half of the parallelogram ABD. Okay, so half of area of parallelogram ABD. E. The reason is again same as one. So this triangle is also standing on the base AB and it is also between the parallel lines CD and AB. And since the triangle and parallelogram both are standing on AB and between same parallel lines CD and AB, this triangle also should be half of the ABD. Now what we can write is the area of this triangle ABD is equal to the area of this triangle ABC because they are both equal to half of ABD. So area of triangle ABD is equal to area of triangle ABC. So from our statement 1 and 2, we got these two triangles are equal. So our reason is going to be from statement 1 and 2. And proved. We have proved our zero. We needed to prove that ABD is equal to ABC, right? These two triangles standing on the same base between the same parallel lines are equal. So if you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for future maths videos. Thank you.